Hey, welcome back everyone. Toys is here and I'm back yet again for the very first McFarlane Toys DC Multiverse vid of 2024. We are now officially into year five. Pretty crazy, right? But we have the brand new Target Gold Label exclusive Red Tornado. Target loves their red action figures and yes, Red Tornado has a lot of red to him. Now, this is being billed as one of those DC classic figures, which I got no problems with. You get a nice photo of Red Tornado on the back, and here's the barcode if you want to head into store and look for him. But he is available on the Target app, and I will have affiliate links down in the description below if you want to go ahead and order him now. But in the meantime, this is going to be an absolute blast. So sit back, relax, grab yourself a nice hot cup of coffee. This is a look at the brand new McFarlane Toys DC Multiverse Target Store Gold Label Exclusive Red Tornado. And real quick, for all you new DC Comics fans out there, if you have no idea who the Red Tornado is, well, utilizing our patented card stand, we can read up on old John Smith. So now, here's everything taken out of the packaging, and I'll save you some time. This is a great utilization of prior established parts and pieces to make a new figure because we are getting a set of open hands which look really great for a character like Red Tornado and we get punchy hands in case you want to take your android anger out on the Riddler. I really like this Cyclone. Now I do know that is a reuse from the Black Adam Cyclone. It does have a peg hole on the bottom so you can utilize the Black DC Multiverse stand and it has a peg hole inside as well. This situates beautifully. He actually stands quite nicely with or without the black stand applied. The hands open, that looks great. And because it's a nice effect piece and because we have multiple hands, you can use it to where, yes, the Riddler was enveloped into a giant twister. Now, in terms of the actual Red Tornado himself, like I said, it's very cool to start off this new year with looking at an awesome DC Multiverse action figure. You're going to get a reuse of a body we've gotten before. I like the pirate boots. I like the yellowish goldish trim all over the costume. And I particularly like his big chunky blue cape. There's no excessive textures anywhere on this figure. And I'm stoked on that. They've even painted the trim on the cape. Although in some areas it could have been painted just a little bit better. But in terms of the costume, the T on his chest, the belts, everything about the costume looks fantastic. Of course, until you get to the top of the cape where he does not have these medallions, typically. He's drawn in various ways, but yes, this is a reuse of that cape. It was near perfect, but it's still a really cool figure, and you're going to get the same type of DC Multiverse articulation out of him. Nothing crazy, legs kick out, although at this point, I really wish they would fix the color of that toe joint right there. The pin could be red, just saying, five years in. But in totality, with the hands to the effect piece and this figure, it's a pretty solid red tornado. But if you were to give him a flight stand, you can really make this character come to life, especially with other Justice League type teammates as we've been gradually putting our DC Multiverse collections together over these last many years. And especially now, with 2023 being a great year for adding particular characters, yes, you can really start building out your superhero team in the way of the 7-inch McFarlane Toys DC Multiverse lineup. And yes, that's an Action Comics number one Superman head on the Superman 1000 body. So that will wrap it up for my quick look at the brand new McFarlane Toys DC Multiverse Target Gold Label Exclusive, the Red Tornado. And it's one of the best exclusives that they've done in a while because of the totality of the character. From the hands to the effect piece, showing powers, that's always great. The reds, the blues, the golds. Minus a little part in the cape. Let's just see less reuse in 2024 and more just spot on amazingness for the DC Multiverse line. So you've heard my thoughts and now I'm curious to know yours. Comment below. Let me know. Let's talk everything Red Tornado 
And I'm going to leave you guys with that. As always, drink some great coffee, eat some great food. But most importantly, remember, here's to a grand year for the McFarlane Toys DC Multiverse lineup. 2024 should be awesome. And when it is, let me know what you found. I'll talk to you guys soon. Adios.